My name is Day9, and I have big hair. Yes, we're going to play some Mechabellum. 1v1. I haven't played Mechabellum in like... Well, goodness, probably like two weeks, three weeks, something like that. No, it's been three weeks. Oh, my God. And what what a sad three weeks it's been. I'm going to try to ladder up. I don't know what my MMR is going to be, but you know I'm only going to play ranked, baby. You know I'm only going to play ranked. And we're probably going to build some flanking fortresses. Now, sweetie pie, i got to scoot you just a little bit. No, 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 no. Rhino speed, elite supply. Oh, man. Ah, uh, how do I want to do this? How do I want to start this? Speed specialist. I think the movement speed of three is pretty sweet, but I'm gonna I'm gonna do I'm gonna do elite specials. I think elite specials is really fun. Bum 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 ba -da -ba -dum. What does my opponent have? It has fangs and storm crawlers. Ah, uh, fangs and storm crawlers. I mean, and I have mustangs. Well, that's a weird one to get. I just want to unlock the fortress right now. But, ah, uh, jeez. I'll only be able to make the singular arc light. Ah, uh, why not? Put some of these turkeys back here. Some of these turkeys back here. Uh, where do we want the Mustangs? Actually, I think I want the Mustangs off to the side here, because Mustangs can shoot air. So, and you know me, I'm a big fan of the Fortress Flanks and Wasp Flanks, so we want to deal with those guys right away. You know what? Why not? Deeply discouraging of Flancos. Alright. I don't know if this is any good, but there it is. This is the game. Oh, he, was, he has an elite marksman? Aw, oh, farts. Alright, well... This is a lot. There's a lot of fangs. This might actually be pretty good in mid. Oh, goodbye, elite marksman. Hey, we're, we're doing some stuff here, man. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Genmanade, good to see you. Yeah, Mechabellum is definitely an RTS auto battler fusion, for sure. That is precisely how I would describe it. So the idea is, I'm going to place mechs, and when the round begins, I... And it's one-on-one -on -one game. My mechs are just going to arbitrarily march around. Arbitrarily is the wrong word. They will, in a very specified way, march from my side to their side. Blowing up stuff. Um, so, for instance, I have these, these pair of crawlers that are picking away at the enemies. Get them, guys. Get them. So you have different mechs that have different strengths and weaknesses. And you also have these uh, two towers here. So you'll see one here. You'll see another one here. If one of those towers dies, it deals a massive debuff of damage. So, like, my units only deal, like, 10% damage after this blows up. And it's temporary. So eventually my dudes will go back to normal again. But you'll see it's going to blow up. Bang! You'll see my guys are all electrocuted. It's very sad. Nano repair kit. You absolutely know I'm getting this shit. It's 200 to unlock, but I want to build two of these. All right, that's going to be a little tricky. Go ahead and unlock my steel balls. Get my arc light upgraded. So the idea is each in between rounds, I get to unlock one mech, and then I get to buy two mechs. And I can also do things like purchase little upgrades for my guys. And these upgrades will, in theory, let me solve various problems. Dude, I know exactly what's going on in this game. And so you'll note that all the units, wherever you place them, there they shall remain. That is the way of things. So, I know that my opponent has a lot of these little tiny swarmy fangs. And therefore, this makes me want to get things that deal AoE damage, which you see I'm ripping things up over here. Looks like I won this left side really hard. So since I broke through on the left, I'm going to blow up this tower. And now you'll see see all these missiles coming in. They deal hardly any damage. That's because of the debuff. You can see that they're electrified. 
Now, I do need to worry a little bit because this marksman is definitely going to be able to pick away this. You can see that these towers are super weak. And so the question is, do I actually have enough damage? This marksman is blowing up the shit out of everything. But it, it looks like we're going to be okay. My little swarmy tiny babies are just going to break through here. A win is a win is a win. Get him, guys. I will note, these, these games are, like, taking quite a, quite a while. Quite a while. Like, these rounds, excuse me. Um, so, if I unlock this, they'll be at 350. Yeah, I'm gonna, definitely going to do this. I think that if I make a fortress and give it nano regeneration, we'll just, like, auto-win. Okay, so I'm going to go one, two, and I'm going to upgrade these ones in the middle. So I'm continuing to get these arc lights, because again, my opponent has a lot of fangs. And I think that if I can just blow up these fangs and let my swarmy dudes in, we'll be in good shape. Does this just last around? I'm just going to chill. All right, my opponent is getting yet more storm callers and is getting the... Splash damage range by 5 meters, but decreases attack by 40%. Ah, I see. So my opponent is going for AoE focus. Yeah, I think we're, we're literally going to annihilate super, super badly here. My opponent is... Dude, fuck my opponent. I'm the best. <laughs> Screw this intelligent sounding commentary. No, I'm done with this garbage, man. All right, so it looks like my opponent uh, upgraded their artillery to get the extra range. Or excuse me, not range, but extra radius on their AOE damage. So we're, we're, we're getting this guy. I already unlocked the balls. What shall I do? I'm actually going to put this over here. <laughs> Here's my fortress. Yeah, it looks like my opponent chose the increased firepower. I mean, this guy, if I can get this fortress leveled up, it's so, it's so insane. It's so insane. Like, because this heals 4.5% of its max HP per second. That was a good one. Yeah, dude. Oh, flanking fortress. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck yeah, man. Go get him. All right, now, see, so here's, here's what's insane, right? Here's what is absolutely, truly insane. I'm going to lose all of my units except the fortress which means this fortress is going to be able to spend time knocking down these shields all right he's indestructible he's fucking in trouble there's one come on get to level three huh get to level three just do it he got to level three dude oh my god cha 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 all right subsidized steel ball Upgrade. Steel balls. I, I'm pleased to announce that the steel balls are all arriving here on the flag. I also want to give this the barrier. Uh, I actually am going to 
Do I want to take out a loan? I think I do. Still holding on to this. Electromagnetic shot? Alright. <laughs> Alright. Th this is a huge shield. This is a big shield. Bring back wolf shirt Wednesday. I only ever had one wolf shirt, and I did, in fact, consistently wear it every Wednesday. Is there any flanking coming in from villain? No. So many snipers. Remember, my opponent has subsidized snipers. And I think you you know that what we're doing next is we're getting crawlers. Dude, look at this. This is this is annihilation. This is annihilation. You something to upgrade the fortress god most recent patch. Uh, it's like they have they have like gamma fisting or something like that. <laughs> I think is the name of it. Um, can I can I just go for a win right here? So I definitely want to get the crawlers. Definitely want to get this. Can I just? Oh shit, there's a sentry missile right there. Alright, I'm bad. I'm gonna take out a loan, and I'm gonna get this and this. I'm gonna get another one of these here. I think I can just win on this run. So this is gonna be uh, uh, Tungsten Town? Oh shit, I forgot anti air. Right. Well, good luck to my Mustangs, you know? I think we, 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 I think I literally just win. I think. Especially if I can break through on this side. Yeah, I mean, this, lo this looks like a win. I guess technically a draw is possible with this. Dude, it's literally shooting the thing that has like infinite regen. It's just shooting the thing that has infinite regen. Eat shit! Open eat shit! <laughs> yes! Yeah, so this, this is actually not a win. I mean, that's actually bad news bears, for sure. Like, I'm, I'm genuinely, like, a little bit concerned about this. Deployable units to three? Okay, so I think, I think I'm definitely going to need to do some loans here. So I think that I need to get this uh, anti-air. Anti-air, one, two, three. I mean, don't think I'm not doing that shit. 100%, like it's not close. Like we're doing that. So I wanna win on this side. Can't upgrade anything else. Actually, I'm pretty, I'm pretty content with that. Take out a loan. Range and speed. Steel balls? Health regeneration? Okay. <laughs> I see. I see. I mean, this one shots the balls, so that's good. Where? Oh, shit, is the overlord over here somewhere? They sold it! Oh my god, they sold that shit. Yo, dude, I'm the best. Holy shit, this is the... Uh-oh. 
Oh, the flanking fortress has succeeded. Flanking fortresses, man. I think we still win. I think I can get up here and destroy this, maybe, one time. Come on. Yes, fuck yeah. So these all have linked health. Oh, this is close as fuck, man. How do I actually want to do this? How do we want to do this shit? you to get the attack and the probably just the range uh actually do i just want elite crawlers maybe 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 that's what we want maybe we just want crawlers on mass huh I don't remember who has my EMPs on this. I think it's my storm crawlers. I think I just need to out damage these things. Yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, did I already take out a loan? Oh fuck! All right. Sometimes you just screw up. No, I'm actually just gonna do like this, man. Oh shit, I ran out of time. Holy fuck, man. I mean, we have a lot of crawlers here, man. All their health is fucking linked together. That's a sick upgrade. So, I mean, I'll get the EMP boost in a few turns, but it looks like we're losing that one pretty fucking handily. Damn it. All right, well, we'll just keep we'll just keep going all in. Cha-cha-cha-cha. All right, well, we're going to do, like, this. Deployable thing here. I'm just going to get this turkey here. We're doing it. It'd be nice if I could break through on this side, but I don't think I will. Mmm. Shit. I mean, this shield is, is helpful. As long as this guy steps out, I think I'll be happy. Didn't fucking work at all. Holy shit, dude. These guys are fucking unstoppable. What do we do? What do I do? I lost. All right. 
RPG. All right, turn. I I literally have no idea how the flanking fortress didn't work. Yeah, I mean the um, giant lady looks like just tickles. All those things have their health linked together. Um, I needed to. I kept what I. So here's the mistake that I that I had. What I needed to do was get my EMP unit out. EMP is an ability that you can add on to things that disables whatever research your opponent gets. And what I said to myself was, hey, I think that I'm okay. I think I don't need to worry about getting that because I want to win on this turn. That's what I want to do. I want to win on this turn. And I think the reason that was a mistake is that obviously I kept not winning on that turn and I kept taking out loans. A loan is you um, get 200 now, but you have 300 less the next turn. So I just kept doing that again and again and again and again and again. If I get EMP, it just it just blows all that shit up. Something weird's happening here. All right, all right. I already know how we're gonna win this. We're gonna be good. Max TB says, hackers work super good against balls, if I might suggest. I mean, there'll be a time and place when I start asking for suggestions. Because, I mean, the... the I don't mind... As usual, I don't mind conversation amongst yourselves or saying, like, I like hackers against balls. Uh, and I like kind of how softly you um, communicated in that case. It's fucking great. Uh, but, like, in general... I want backseating if I have no ideas of what to do, which is pretty uncommon. Uh, because for me, I think that the bigger mistake that I would want to avoid next time is, man, I really should, if there is a very strong unit like that, first of all, understanding that it's strong, great. Uh, this is a pretty stacked sideline. Yeah, I think we're going to win because we're going to get to this thing first. Um. Oh, dude, this is going to be so great if we can just have them target our snipers first. Oh, yeah, it feels so good. What was I going to say? Yeah, I think the big one is I tried to go all in and win that turn. And then it didn't work, so I tried to go all in again and win that turn. And then it didn't work, and then I tried to go all in again. That didn't work. Uh, subsidized crawlers? Bro. Dude. You know, if I may just note... What? Oh, decrease the upgrade cost crawler. Oh, fuck. <laughs> crawlers. <laughs> crawlers. Crawlers. Yes. Yes. I'm just going to get this right now. Well, that fucking sucks. You got wasps. Shit. We're fucked. We're hosed. Well, I'm just going to get anti-air on these guys. It's going to be fine. My god, someone use wasps the way that I do. That's fucking sick. I'm dead. GG. This game is so fun. Even when you lose, it's so fun. Uh, Geminade, uh, can everyone help spam me that Gem... Yo. Fuck yeah. Oh, 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 fuck. Yes, dude. Oh, my God. It's me. Reads the game, man. Holy shit. This is going to be so good. <laughs> oh. 
Oh my god, they can fucking shoot the sky! Look out! We're shooting the sky later today. I mean, we still might lose some snipers on the ground, but like still, I'm just having a ball. Oh, never mind, I'm the best player ever lived. Actually, Genmanade, let me let me take your question. Let me take your question, Genmanade. Genmanade? Genmanade. Where are you, Genmanade? Genmanade, repaste your question. It was a great question. Gentlemen, says, Dana, I still have no RTS experience. I feel like I'd be missing out the picture, but I picked this game up. Any advice on starting out for someone with no RTS knowledge? Um, a nano repair kit, you say? I'm going to get this improved firepower control system in case I need to really cook some shit. But I think right now, what I'm largely going to do is... I am going to get the range upgrade on arc lights. I'm going to go arc light, arc light again. All right, I'm just, I'm just going to keep it pretty simple for now. But yeah, um, so first of all, I would say if you're worried about RTS knowledge with this game, totally don't. This game is just fun as shit. It's just giant mechs walking around. And the interactions in this game are very much so learnable without any background. I'd strongly recommend this. It's a lot of fun. And so I think the thing that makes an RTS game the most feel like an RTS game is when there are multiple mini games happening at the same time that you're trying to manage. So for instance, if I am thinking about something like um, Age of Empires 2, the RTS I streamed most recently, in that game, you are sending workers around to build things. You're looking at four different resources and reallocating the workers. You're trying to constantly build from all of your structures, you're controlling your units, you're maybe sending a priest out to get a relic and bring it back. That's what makes it feel RTSy, the ability of managing and considering all these things that are kind of happening at the same time. So I think given that you're not, like you, you don't have experience in RTS, I think it's completely fine. I think you're just gonna have a blast if you play this. Dude. This arc light play that I did, this is broken. I think I need to focus on steel balls next. Steel balls that make little crawls. Dude, these guys on the right. I mean, this was perfectly timed. Hey, Nelly Devo, good to see ya. What up, Nelly? Um, yeah, so I, I think that what I actually need to do in this round is I need to do like this. I need to get these up. Because if my opponent gets that, I'm a, I'm a wee bit hosed. And do I actually want to take out a loan for these? No, I think I'm just going to get one more arc light, and I think that's actually okay. I just am so convinced that my opponent is going to be dropping an EMP on me. They're not. Holy shit, they have EMP storm callers. All right, nice. So this is where I want to emphasize more crawlers, I think. I think we might lose this really badly. That's pretty nice. Like, you use these to disable my dudes. So now I actually don't have any anti-air. Oh, that's pretty sweet. That's pretty sweet. All right, so how do I want to deal with that shit? OK. 
Okay. So I did get the EMP storm, which is really good. So if I get missile mustangs, is that actually going to be good? How much does it cost to unlock a Mustang? 50? Missile Interceptor? And this is... I take out a loan. In order to get... Another one of these guys. I don't need to do that this turn, honestly. I actually will put this on this now. This is not a good idea. Oh, am I the greatest player that's ever lived? Yeah, no, I am. Look at this. EMP goes down. This disables all their tech, so now these Stormcallers can't disable my tech because I disabled their tech to be able to disable my tech. And now this is going to be the easiest game you ever did see. Whoa. Well, there's the nuke that landed. Uh, it was not a close game. <laughs> Alright, well. Oh, fuck. Alright, well, I will do this again. So I think I need to... I'm just going to get both of these, and I'm going to get this, and I'm going to just go. Why not? I mean, th this should be a freaking massacre, I think. Not 100%, but I think it should be. Yeah, dude, I'm I'm just completely shutting down the storm trawlers. They're not they're just not getting close. And that's great, because then I can have my arc lights actually doing the damage and cleaning up. Oh my god, yeah. Oh dude, hell yes. Oh my god, that's the first time I've used that Mustang counter. That feels great. Oh yeah. Oh my god, yeah, we did it. Feels excellent. Where'd, where'd my window go? Return to lobby. Is there a hockey for upgrading unit? I don't think so. I just click it. What my? I th I'm at three thousand four hundred and seven. What? 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 Cause like, said, you enjoy vacation, dude? Went to Mexico. Mexico's fucking beautiful, man. And this, I mean, I'm, what I'm about to say is just is, is going to sound really stupid. Um, heavy armor? Thicker babies? Mm -hmm. I think elite specialist is really cool, but I've never tried heavy armor specialist that much. I'm going to try that. Uh, but like... 
the thing that I've just never quite actually mentally thought about is that when you cross the border from California to Mexico, the biome is exactly the same because they're touching. Okay, these guys, these guys are the same speed. That's my bad. Like, I, I, like that's that's. I know that's this very stupid sounding thing to say, but it was something that was like very weird for me to like see, because the architecture and the way the streets are arranged and all the advertising, it's all completely different. And there's something about it that just felt felt really strange to me. Because this was the first time that I walked through a border. So normally there's like a transition period when going from one country to another. Where, you know, you... I think my little arc light might get a, a good shot in it too. I like arc lights. I like them very much. Yeah, I mean, like, you know, when normally, if, like, for instance, if I fly from uh, America to, like, in California in America to Kansas in America, it's just very muggy when you get there. Like, super duper duper ultra muggy. Oh my god, yes. All right. Hi, my name is Sean Arclight Spam. I'll unlock crawlers because that's a good one to have. And it's like, I get on the plane, and it's hot and dry and deserty, and then I land there, and it's just like, humid and muggy. And nasty. Oh, a fortress, you say? A fortress, you say? I want to save my money, because I want to start spamming arc lights. Oh, 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 no! Dude, I've been sentry misaloned. I don't know. I was twang hot and then I died. <laughs> They'll never expect my balls. Chum, chum, chum. -cha. This is one of my favorite things to get. No. I mustn't. What now? So I'm going to get the range of arc lights. I'm going to unlock the steel balls, and I'm still just going to build two more arc lights. Because so what's nice about getting range early is it lets them... Uh, just get a bunch of experience. No! My opponent is learning. Um, I'm just going to get a shield here and a shield here, dude. I don't care. I just can't afford these kinds of massive losses. See, then when I shoot from a far range, they, they can just get so much XP so quick. It's so nice. I'm just literally gonna. I'm gonna go shield the arc light. I mean, I know. I know I'm getting gronkled. <sighs> I mean, I may as well just keep upgrading this guy. I can be pretty low econ here, so I'm actually going to take out a loan. No, 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 no. I think it's fine. I think it's actually fine. Great play. I was thinking the same thing. I really need some steel balls, I think, too. Like, back here to come in and hit this. What? Fortress launches his fist to attack enemies, triggering once when it's below 70. The range of the rocket punch is that. Oh, yeah. I don't, I don't, I don't actually know how this works.
about to get grunched, I think. I don't actually know. How much damage do these do? A thousand? Holy shit! Fisted. Holy shit! Doubled. This is the one that's actually dealing all the damage here. So I think I lose this. Because this is just going to send in the fist. <laughs> okay. Oh, Giant Hunter. Oh, Range Specialist. Dude, that's just it. These guys will spawn these turkeys. All right, so I, I actually really super duper duper ultra need to uh, take out the loan here. Upgrade this. Instant level up. Upgrade this. Oh, shit. My opponent's going to put on missiles again, aren't they? We're both loaning. Acid Crawler seems good. That might be good, yeah. Oh, no! Fuck, we're so fucked, man. Dude, we're gonna lose this round. We're dead. We're done. Dude, I... I mean, that's brutal. That is a brutal death. Yeah, I think I overinvested in arc lights. I don't think I can destroy this. Now, I, I think I still have a pretty good amount of health. I think. I'm not 100% sure on it, but... Dude, the, these fists are incredible. So I have... So I don't think I die, but I'm gonna... I'm taking some pain. Some pain and spain. I am literally doing this across the board. And we're gonna take out a loan. Oh, a little broke. Get the crawlers. Upgrade this shit. No, uh, let's actually increase the movement speed of all units by a little bit. Alright, I mean, that, seems, that feels good. Yeah, I was kind of expecting this sort of thing to be a likely outcome. Oh, I forgot to place those. Fuck, that was really bad. So I think we maybe just lose. Oh, this is my first time with against the new Fisticuffs ability. And that is some good shit. Oh, maybe, maybe, maybe we're gonna pull it off? It doesn't feel like it. This this fist shoot thing it seems insanely good. Oh, dude, this level six arc light. Mmm. 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 Whew. That was close. So I upgrade you. Get this. Upgrade you again. I'm trying to think of how to do this. Oh, God. 
I don't really know where to place this thing. So I'm going to put this like... Because the shield won't hit it, right? I kind of want to get wasps. And just do wasps. I also kind of want to get this, but I already... I already spent. Fuck. You know, I'm just going to do like this. I think that this should still be very good. Hey, hey. Alright, I think I just literally straight lost. Oh shit, he did get air units. Oh, maybe? One time? One time? Nope. So I think we... This is this is a hard loss, right? Because we just don't have any anti-air. Yeah, okay. So, so... I did panic a little when I saw the fortresses. Uh, with their, like, huge fisty things. And I just wasn't sure what to do. But I think, upon some reflection, I think that what I actually needed to do was not overreact to them too much. Honestly, we were doing okay when we were just really focusing on the arc lights and arc light damages. And I think I just should have gotten the elite marksman upgrade for the arc light. That, that's actually what I think. It's just gone all in on the arc lights that shoot. Um, because I was trying different things like getting swarmy crawlers, trying to get some um, steel balls, but I think the problem with what I did there, um, was I, I kind of like did some half solutions. Because like if I got crawlers, I was like, hey, maybe this will be helpful. And then it would get to low health and it would shoot and it would just like one shot huge things in AOE. I mean, that was pretty sick. I'm gonna do elite specialist again. Um, I really like Elite Specialist, and I really like this composition of units, so. I think Wasps was incorrect in that last round, because it felt like a sort of, oh my god, if I get Wasps and I don't have enough anti-air, maybe I'll just, like, get a win, but then I have useless things. Hmm. So let's see here. So I have Elite Specialist. Should we get an arc light? Put this turkey in the middle and just be a little off kilter. Haven't gotten a lot of these upgrades in a little bit. Fucking cool. I've been seeing a lot more players do this sort of thing, and I, I think it's pretty sweet. Actually, I think it's going to turn out good for this guy. I think? No. He's targeting the wrong turkey. Get him! Go! Oh, yeah, I'm just rooting for this guy. Holy shit! A single health! A single health remains. Alright. You got me. Decreases the recruitment cost of marksman by 50. That actually seems pretty good. Especially when I have this elite. Especially I have this elite quality to me. Yeah, may as well. Is my opponent also a oh, they're a giant specialist? Okay. Yeah, I'll probably need to put a line of balls here and a line of balls here. Missile, missile would have done well? Sure, but, you know, I, I I kind of don't really mind that much just losing some health early on. Like, suppose my opponent just... What? Wow, that's, that's a pretty big spin. All right. 
Yeah, I mean, like, I, I don't mind losing a round early on. It just doesn't really matter that much. Health is a resource. There it is. I think, I think this is going to be absolutely perfect. Uh-oh, balls on balls. But I have the crawler on crawls action. I, I, I have lost a couple times to players putting their shit right at the front. I think I, think, I, think I did this Continue to focus on steel balls versus steel balls because all my shit starts at level two. And I also think I should be a little careful about unlocking too many pricey things. Yep, completely fine. Yeah, because I saw the electromagnetic storm and was like, man, if they take this, this will fuck up some of this stuff here, but then I'll just kill from behind and then we'll easily, easily, easily win. And the, the crawlers come back in two turns. Oh, thank you, thank you. I do need to move the day night TV logo. I'm so sorry about that. I mean, we're winning, so you don't actually need to see the fight. Yeah, this this was a this was a grung point. Ah, oh, shit. Let me turn it off and turn it back on again. I really need to spend this weekend doing some setup, man. Hold on. Oh, range specialist. How much health does everyone have? How much health does this have? So this is where I actually think that I want to go arc light, arc light, and I want to get the range upgrade on the arc light to upgrade these guys. I think this is gonna earn. See, I, I think I gotta be really careful about unlocking too much stuff. And I think that these two marksmen are going to be more than enough against this bullshit. Waiting for the other player to complete. Yeah, see, look. This is going to come up a turn earlier than this is going to come up. <laughs> Mustafa says, loving some ball-on-ball -ball action. There's nothing more thrilling and exciting watching someone else mash their balls. <laughs> I'm not even going to add any more to the sentence. It came out right the very first time. Uh, level 2 balls. Hey, I was thinking the same thing. You know what I really want? I really want to... What I, what I kind of am wishing... I'm going to put one crawler set over there, man. That's <laughs> such a funny fight. I think I'm lacking some durability in the middle. But dude, these ranged arc lights doing good, good shit. This is when people put their units in aggro, they're definitely underestimating how much experience you can get from buying a couple sentries. Wait, like, like... I thought you got no experience if you do something up with sentries. I thought that was the, the conceit. Alright, so here, here's what I think. I 
I think my opponent is simply not going to have the flanks covered and I can Gronkle this way. And my opponent has 1,300 health left. Here's what we're going to do. Yeah, this is this is the game. This is the game. Yeah, I'm thinking I can win this right now. God, sentries fucking suck. All right, I completely misread what was happening, but I still think that my wish to try to win right now is is gonna be granted. Gronkled. Yep, done. Smashed, smushed, and absolutely mushed. This is it doesn't matter the XP from destroy units, you win the fight easily and get XP from there. Okay, let me let me be more clear. I thought that the only place in this game that you could get experience was if unit A killed unit B, unit A would get experience. That's the, that's the thought that I, I I thought you'd only get it in that way. Is that is that actually right? Or is that an incorrect understanding? Hey, what up, Tuesday Twitch? Assist get you XP? I don't know what that means. So, so if unit A damages unit B and then something else kills B, A still gets experience, is that right? Uh, it's not. XP for hazards is shared across all alive units. What's a hazard? Ooh. Supply specialist? 50 supplies per round with fangs? I love fangs. Pop, pop, pop. ba da ba ba Crawler. Fang, fang. You know what? I'm gonna be like this guy. I'm doing this shit. You know, I I'm gonna do something kinda like this. I'm gonna leave one one space in front because fuck it, why not? No screw it. We're absolutely mashing the front line. I need to get a little bit of space. <clears throat> a little bit of space. Is this good? Unlikely. Am I committing? 100%. Alright, I'm ready. <laughs> it's hacker time! It's hacker time. Here we go. Get him, boys. I don't know. We're fucking dead as shit, but that's fine. That's fine. I'm going to get 50 extra supply per round. Dude, I lost so much fucking health there. That is actually so funny. Oh, a rhino. Uh, dude, I'm actually so vulnerable to flanks. Right on the turkey. <laughs> oh my god, I was literally, I was so tempted to drop it right fucking there, you know? Uh It's fucking time, bro. I think I shouldn't have done them in the center. I think I should have done them all on one side. What's also getting fongs? What? 
What? Getting farms? What? All right, it's fine. I can see that I will lose this round as well. It's fine. Finally. Ugh. Ugh. This game is fu so fun to spectate. It really, it's it's a lot of fun, Bitterland. I've been watching a lot of Endo, uh, Endozoa stream. Hi. Oh. Oh. Well, guess who's fucked? It's your pal, Sean. Two, two rhino punches and Sean's done. I do believe that we were winning on this in this front, though. It's okay. It's okay. No, no. I, I, I'm, I'm used to getting clubbed in these games. It's fine. Will my opponent take round one. A uh, marksman specialist. Dude, I'm fucking clapped. <laughs> oh my god, how is this fucking possible? Uh, what is this? Okay, so I'm gonna get... Hacker. This is just literally, this is not what we should be doing. But I, I, I'm, I'm just trying something that I've never even remotely close to have tried before, am trying before. We're just giving it a go. We're giving it a whirl, as it were. And where's the one that can make these? Yeah, I think what I need to do is I need to get range on my fangs. Wow, this guy clearly watched my stream. He's just going straight up for, oh wait, I did, I did get an Assault Vulcan. Yeah, I really need the range on these, so that way I, I, I don't have their bodies run to the front. Yeah, I, I forgot that I need to get the range on these things. Okay, I messed up. That's fine. Sledges are pretty good. Here's the thing. I believe... I believe... Putting our opponent on everybody's Vulcans is a viable strategy. I, I sure thought so, you know? All right, so so I think I'm going to go hacker free one more round. Cha 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 cha. Range. I'm just literally not going to worry about it. Figure it out. I, I wish I could control Z that upgrade. All right, this, this is this is it. This is the game right here. Fuck! <laughs> oh, fuck, man. Oh, shit. Fucking hell. It's fine. We're gonna win over here, probably. <laughs> Why would he build a Vulcan? We kill this Vulcan, we're fucking sick, dude. I mean, it's pretty close. Fucking blow, blow this up! Oh, they already all got cooked. Fuck. Okay. So we, we need to go straight for this fuckhead. Oh, shit. I mean, you gotta admit it was close. <laughs> ah, fucking hell. I want to win there. Level twos. You fucking loan. Barrier.
The rhinos are coming up here, huh? Fuck. Alright, so this this was actually a pretty good one. Maybe I should have done like this, but you know, these we have got these guys. Oh, we are just crunching. Alright. Give him to me! Give me the fuck! Just turn around! Yep. Hackers. Yeah, hackers. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Alright, it was very easy. I'm not gonna lie, this was fucking trivial easy. It's fine. All right, level two. Uh, how much is the multi grab? No, I still need the loan. Rhino's gonna airdrop here because I know he's gonna fuck with me. I want to upgrade these guys, but I really think I'm all in on the hackers. Let's hope our opponent forgets to use the Rhino. The shield device only works on item shields, not upgrade shields. What? Fuck! I feel like I've learned this like six times! How do loans work? Yeah, so a loan over here is you get 200 immediately, but you lose 300 next round. Oh, he forgot. He fucking forgot. Oh, I'm, I'm, I got him. Oh, shit. Hacker Fang. Hacker Fang. It is the bee's knees. Oh, it's it's neck and neck. Shit, I really need this multi-hack, don't I? This guy flanks me. I just, like, fucking immediately lose. Alright. It's just, he's just going all in on Vulcans. This is what I did when I tried to do my hacker shit. Or when I was losing to hacker shit. I really wish I could have afforded some of these speed and range upgrades. That would have been, I think, critical here. I think they're right at the front. I'm going to get them first. Holy shit, hackers are fucking awesome. Oh, what the fuck, wasps? No, he fucking built wasps! Oh my god! But that's okay, wait, 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 we have a lot of anti-air because we have a lot of fangs. Just keep slurping. Oh, fucking go, fucking get him. Oh, fucking please. Please, you fucking pieces of shit. Yeah, fucking become on fire. Hackers are awesome. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice flank. 
Nice flank, dude. <laughs> yeah, man, do you like my sound effects? Oh, that's me being a hacker for Halloween. Not even Halloween. I do what I want. Excellent. <laughs> uh, we have slayed a Dagron. We have taken gold from the Dagron. Ah, Dagron down. Return to lobby. <laughs> oh. oh, my MMR pending is 98 bigger than it once was. I'm at 46.16. Man, I have so many combat fists. Matchmake. Dude, I literally, I, I want to show you a photo of this garbage can at some time. What? Get me out of here. Uh, like, I, I, I have this problem. Okay, I have this problem, which is that if we have fizzy water in the house, I do not drink regular water until I have consumed all the fizzy water in the house. Speed. Why not? Is there fizzy water of choice? I don't give a shit. I really don't care. What, what kind of fizzy water I get that is? That, that's not like I heard your question. I was like, I don't give a shit who you're asking here. Yeah, go for it. Go for the butt. Good cat. Good cat. Right here. Right here. All right. Hi, sweetie pie. Hello. Yes. Yes, you're my girl, and I love you. I think I'm going to go hack or steal ball, because it's like my favorite thing to do. Buy your own fizzy water creating thingy. They're relatively cheap. Here's the thing, Gisp. Here's what I like about buying fizzy water from a from a box, is that you just take it, done, you drink it. As opposed to one of those things where you got to fucking... You have to, like, insert it up into this thing. And you, like, it feels like you're drowning something every time you're carbonating the water. You, and then you pull it out, and you, then you pour it. Oh, look, I made it myself. Like, mm-mm. That motion? Yeah, no, it's revolting. Ooh, this is gonna be close. Shoot, shoot her! Shoot her! I've got him. I'm gonna actually get this. I'm actually going to unlock the Rhino. I'm going to build a Rhino. I'm going to put it right over there. I'm going to get another Arc Light. Put it probably. I have no idea to air on the flanks. All right, I'm just going to put this here. This will just stay for a while. Totally fine with that. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna super duper crush this. Oh, dude, it's mid-air. It applied the bluff when it was mid-blast. Did building up front actually benefit you last round? It Well, it does because you can begin hacking, like, right away. Ran uh, a random orbits is good luck. Have fun. This game looks like a good time with low barrier of entry. That's a perfect descriptor of it. Oh, I think we lose here. Yeah, we're dead. <laughs> we won! We're gronkling! Yeah, so if you destroy one of these buildings, it does a massive long-term debuff to your units. So it'll be like a 15 second, your units move at half speed and deal 10% damage. It's it's pretty it's pretty incredible. Uh I think 
I may as well get this. Pull my guy back. Why not? Put it over here and we'll go ahead and get the balls. I don't really have a target to launch this at yet. <laughs> I, uh, yeah, I need to get the anti air here, huh? I misunderstood that that was an option, this multi drop thing. lose to the wasps, but I mean arc light anti-air, arc light range. I really like my arc lights. I like the carry arc light build like a lot. Do they have EMP on any of these things? No, doesn't look like it. Still just not losing that much health. Pop, pop, pop. Top supply specialist. Fuck yeah, are you kidding me? Are you joking me? Alright, these can be used against aerial units. Bye bye. I know that might look a little... Actually, I'll put them up here. I mean, I'm, it's, too, it's two round cooldown. May as well. Do I want to unlock anything else? Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and unlock the crawlers and tanks. That seems good to get. Yep, I was pretty sure those would be moving somewhere. Where are they moving to? Oh, I'm good, baby. I'm very good. My point, top supply specialist, great. We're both top suppliers. So I think that we're like about to... I did do air units, right? I always confuse the symbols of these. All right, so we're, we're, we're the best. All right, that was, that was okay, that was fine. Yeah, this is super duper not close. Oh, get that experience. I like having just a small handful of marksmen. It feels really good. That's actually a lot closer than I thought it would be. Super closer than I thought it would be. Jeez. Yeah, so if I get range on arc lights, that's going to solve a lot of problems here. Because, I mean, look, they have, like, so many swarmy things. Oh, my God. Yeah, crawlers. Crawlers is going to be good for us. And then I'm going to get the range upgrade on arc lights. And then, you know what? I'm actually going to... Level 2 units can be purchased this round. I'm going to go Arc Light, Arc Light. Yeah. So I, I already have this missile here. Alright, nice. What is my opponent going to field recovery? And they're getting elite somethings. Oh, that's what that noise is. It's like, yeah, I think the range on the arc lights is just like so mega good. Especially against this fleet of flyers. Okay, so this is where I need steel balls with crawlers. They're just massing up on phoenixes. Reality's creeping in behind me. Oh yeah, that's it's actually my monitor. I'm seeing the top of my monitor. Yeah, I think range upgrades are super, super, super busted good in this game. Or 
Or, may or maybe I should actually just get Mustangs. All right, well, this is going to last forever. Yeah, actually, I think this is what I'm going to do. I'm just going to get heavy, heavy Mustangs. And where is the... Yeah, because I think I actually need this Elite Marksman. If I want to be able to do something. Range by 30, but HP by that. Yeah, because I mean, like, now now my dudes have just, like, kind of ridiculous range. These have a range of 160. These guys have a range of 146. As long as I can, like, protect my Mustangs. Because I feel like I want Mustangs just because a lot of their firepower is coming from these Phoenixes that are stacked on this right side here. And they deal a lot of single target damage. Maybe even a Rhino here would be good. What the fuck is this? Why is there phoenixes here? Did I... Where did these come from? What is this doing here? Did I start this with phoenix? Oh, that's right. I did. I did. I did. I started with them. I'm sorry. I just... I thought it was crazy. Because I didn't see a corresponding one there. Oh my god. Wow, like, understanding what's happening with yourself is just so hard. I think that may have been a really terrible choice. Did he do? I think that's true. I am going to commit to this. Is there a tankiness thing? I think I just want good old-fashioned range here. These guys are quite fast, so I'm going to put these back here. I... I, I don't build a lot of Mustangs so I can feel my brain attributing behavior to them they don't actually have. Oh, and I should have gotten these and this range upgrade. That was a mistake. Let's do this, this, and this. And then I... Alright, that's fine. Yeah, because now... Yeah, he's going all in on Phoenixes, so I need to go all in on this arc light plan. Okay. I think I do have heavy Mustang. Yeah, 200% more health. Great. So I already do have like what I can do for tankiness. All right, so. All right, that that looked that looks good. That looks good. That looks really good. I think we I think we did some positive stuff. I guess I will just get this. Let me just upgrade this right away. Amplifying core. All right, we're taking that alone. We're going to try to win right now.
Uh, I'm just gonna build Mustang, Mustang. Yeah, that's fine. We'll 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 just crush that. Super super fine. I like how I got I got the thing that gives me an extra 150 additional supplies per round and I'm just like taking out loans. <laughs> it's 2.4 kill in range. Oh shit, this upgrade. Fuck. I think we will still be okay, because I think that my oh dude, this missiles just did so much fucking damage. Jesus. Right, I'm not dealing quite as much damage to these as I'd like. That's okay, I'll get some steel balls. It's going to be a close death. Hey, if if Phoenixes are resurrecting, does that mean that they Hey, this might actually work. If Phoenixes are resurrecting, does that actually contribute to the amount of damage that is dealt to me at the end of the game? So... One, two, three, four, five. All right. How do I want to do this? I think I'm just going to get a melting point, honestly. the range okay just i was just like please tell me i got the range targets it right away all right that's that's really really good news that one's down this one's down wow that was fast Does one of these have the crawler spawner or something i think i win like the whole game i think i win That's going to be like 800, that's 1200 damage ish. Way more than that. All right, cool. Phoenixes. I want to get this and this. I want to get these two. And what now? Some of these fuckers. This is... Ignites the target unit. Oh, great. This is not the ground igniting thing. Great. Okay, cool. Because yeah, the thing is that these guys have a range of 212, and that's it. That's just fixed at that. But these are just constantly getting more range. Oh, 
Alright, this is attack damage. This is night. Okay, yeah. I, I like the amount of shields we have here. This one is the... Alright, so I hope that we are... We're gonna lose this left side real hard, I think. I need more just stuff on this right side. Oh, there we go. Now we got it locked in. All right, my, my arc lights are awesome. But his phoenixes are also fucking awesome. But my arc lights are awesome, that's the thing. Just throwing it out there. Oh my god, that was close. Respond, my landlord, really fast. All right. Actually, I'm going to take like a two minute break because I got to use a restroom real fast. Uh, when we return, we're going to just keep Mecha Bellaming. Uh, let's see. What are we at? I have some credit. I'm at 5,000 combat power. Mm, 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 mm. 